Hey, g'day, it's Matt here from Matt Carve. So today I'm going to be making a dragonfly out of ebony. This is going to be the body and this is going to be the wings. This is purple heart. If you haven't seen this, this is the actual color of the wood. If you expose it to light or heat, it gets more purpley. Or is that a color? Purpley? Anyway, so that's what I did and it's probably the most fragile work I have ever made. It looks cool. I'm going to release it in the garden and it's going to fly away like a dragonfly. Mm. Okay, so firstly I'm going to actually show you my failures in the wings. So I tried to make these wings really, really thin. And um, they're so thin that when I went to go and burn them with a the torch, they just kept on flaming up or cracking like this. Uh, this one I didn't really like. Uh, it had a hole in it and wasn't too keen on that one so i gave up on that idea and this one here it's um yeah just caught fire so i gave up on the old flame throwing thing and just went back to good old uv treatment okay so now i'm on to the successful wings and i'm cutting them out here on the scroll saw and then i put them onto the disc sander and so here i'm just really trying to get them as thin as i possibly can uh, without them being sucked into the machine. Okay, pretty excited about this. I got a new cut saw burr. This is the tapered coarse one, 3.1 or 1 8 inch that fits in the Dremel. It's really, really good for getting into those tight little areas. Good detail work burr. Yeah, it's uh, good for the eyes there. So if you want any cut saw burrs or anything like that, I do have an affiliate link below where I get a little percentage and you get 5% off the usual price, which is pretty awesome. So that's in the description below. Okay, so one problem I had was attaching the wings to the body. Now, so what I decided to do is I'd hollow out the head and put those little grooves in. Then I glued them in with a sort of two-pack epoxy glue. And then I just let them set. But the problem was then I was left with a real ugly kind of look there. So what I did is I mixed up some of this builder's filler and mixed in some brown and some black and tried to make it sort of yeah similar to the color and uh, there I am applying it and then I wait for it to dry and I then use the Dremel and shape it out so it looks like the head again. Okay so just putting the finishing touches on now I'm going to put some oil on then I'm going to release it into the garden I hope you watch that and um, if you could give me a subscribe that would be awesome too so I can make more butter um, dragonflies not butterflies uh, and release them into the wild. 